Colton, what is that? A scorpion. What's his name? What? Hut. Tuts. <laughs> Tuts. Tuts? Is that his name? We're going to call him Tuts. How awesome does he Tut look? Mr. Squirt. Tut Mr. Squirt. That's right. See this stinger? Yeah. Look at all those hairs. It's so awesome. Like, I can see them through the light. Guys, here we go. Since you guys all say I'm, I'm crazy, here is the Emperor Scorpion. He's uh, probably an adolescent. He's not very big uh, compared to how big they get. Um, with some cool fun facts about him. First of all, as you can tell, he's just walking along like arachnids, like your spiders that everybody is terrified of, they do not, I just, I'm scared he's gonna fall off and hurt himself. They do not bite the ground they're walking on. So as long as he thinks he is just moving along with his business, he's fine. If I was to grab him, I would probably take a sting the cool thing about the Emperor Scorpion is that their sting is very mild. It's very similar to a, to a minor bee sting. Uh, so it would only be an issue if you had an allergic reaction to it. Um, I think it's just another one of those things that the fear of getting stung is worse than the sting itself. Um, but I'm doing this to show you guys that he is harmless. Um, they're very neat. The Emperor Scorpion, uh, at, at this age, would use his stinger in defense. Um, I don't know if you can see that right there. Um, and then it, it has a ton of little hairs all around it. I don't know if you guys can pick that up on the camera. But the, he has those little hairs all over him. They're very sensitive, so they detect uh, vibrations on the ground uh, or in the air, actually, to help him know if a predator was near or food. And then they would, <laughs> I keep I'm talking so I'm breathing on him and I'm hitting those hairs and that's what's got him all going crazy here. He is super active. But again, he is part of the arachnid family with the, with the spiders. Um, and obviously when he eats, he would, <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Breathe it on him. He would take those pinchers, grab his prey, bam, eject the venom. Uh, boom, the, the venom would, would kill it, and uh, he would feed right into his mouth. It's like these little graters in it. And he would just eat it whole, uh, grind it right on down. Probably a terrible way to die. But uh, very, very cool. I've never had a scorpion. So this is a first time for me. I know you guys all think I'm crazy, but gosh, how sweet is that? Terrible, terrible eyesight. So uh, those hairs uh, really detect uh, what's going on. He's probably looking for somewhere to hide. Uh, they do like to stay hidden. They come from uh, the rainforest, uh, actually found in Africa. And they like to burrow. Um, it actually says that they like to find termite mounds and actually go almost as deep as six feet and, uh, and eat all the, the termites. But there you go, the emperor scorpion or tut.